Okay, comparing centric relation records is a challenge because we can take centric relation records at different vertical dimensions of opening. We open about a hinge, so we're opening around the terminal hinge axis. So this is the hinge, of course, and on this device, which is also produced by DNR, it's called the very check, and there's a newer one called a centric check. Through the condyle, we have a stylus, and the maxillary part that you can see fits in between the two stylus styly and um, that allows us to see if each of these three records for example are recording the same position of the condyle and you'll see each one is recorded at a different vertical dimension so the first one here is very thin and you can actually see the RCP contacts through the registration and we can pop that into place we do this with a set amount of models, so we we'll use one CR record to mount the models on a regular articulator, pop, pop it all together, and then when we insert the stylus, a little pin prick goes through the paper, you should have graph paper on here by rights, and you can see that's the centre of the axis that we're rotating about, the terminal hinge axis, and we can do the same on the other side. And now, if our records, if our two, three, four, whatever number of records we've taken are the same, but just at different vertical dimensions, we should be rotating the mandible around that same axis. So if we put a thicker one in now, and put the whole assembly back together, the mandible and maxilla are, are, are of course just related by this centric relation record. Pop the stylus in, and if they're both the same, the pin should go through the same hole, and in this case, it does. So these two centric relation records are the same. Of course, very difficult to know in the patient's mouth whether you've got um, centric relation rec um, recorded correctly. Very difficult to compare two registrations clinically. Very difficult in the lab without one of these devices. The original name was a boonograph. This is an old piece of kit called a very check, and the modern one is called a sentry check. So on modern articulate, the more modern articulators just have the hole in the condyle, which you put those, put the stylus through, and then you have a narrower ma uh, maxillary element which fits in between. Okay, never seen one used in practice, but interesting to see nonetheless.